The existence of corruption within the club is evident, former Barcelona official Amelie Rausord preparing for legal battle with President Giuseppe Maria Bartomeu as bitter dispute rages on six Barcelona officials resigned from the club in protest against Bartomeu former official, Amelie Rausord said somebody was stealing money from the club Barcelona have taken legal action against Rausord but he has now responded the La Liga champions have been plunged into off-field chaos in recent weeks by Kier and Jackson for Mail Online published, 06 BST, the 15th of April 2020, updated, 152 BST. The 15th of April 2020 The war of words at Barcelona continues with former official Amelie Rausord hitting out at the state of the club under Giuseppe Maria Bartomeu's leadership. Rausord, along with five other officials, resigned from the board in protest at how President Bartomeu was running operations. Barcelona also intend to take legal action against Rausord, after his claim that somebody had been stealing money from the club and, he has now elaborated further, insisting that corruption is evident at the new camp. Barcelona President Josep Maria Bartomeu is taking legal action against a former club official in a lengthy statement to Spanish outlet Mundo Deportivo, Rausord responded, The existence of corruption within the club is evident in the fact that it has already been shown that contracts between related companies, one based in a tax haven that violates the money laundering prevention law, have been paid in installments in order to avoid internal controls, approval by the adjudication committee which ensures purchases, are made at market price, and the board of directors. The statements I made regarding this matter are absolutely true and demonstrable, the opinions that I have expressed are absolutely well founded, which allows me to state that the announced complaint has no basis whatsoever. Unfortunately, when I made the club aware of these irregularities it became the cause of my resignation. However, it cannot be underestimated that there is a moral, and legal, obligation to publicly report irregular actions that may constitute crime. Former Barco official Amelie Rausord, far left, has claimed corruption within the club is evident La Liga champions have come under pressure after allegations a company called I3 Ventures, who were originally hired to monitor social media coverage of the club were linked to accounts that produced negative stories about Barcelona players and rivals of Bartomeu. Barcelona have strongly denied these allegations, saying in a statement, in the face of grave and unfounded allegations made by Mr. Emilie Rausord, the club's former vice president, in a number of media interviews, the board of directors categorically denies any action that could be described as corruption and have agreed to bring the corresponding criminal action accordingly. In this regard, the board wishes to emphasize that in the light of these allegations, Price Waterhouse Coopers, PwC, the company in charge of conducting the audit on the monitoring services of social networks contracted by the club, have reiterated that its work is still ongoing and, therefore, is without any provisional or definitive conclusions. It adds, the board of directors have agreed that, once the audit is completed, it will analyze the content and conclusions derived from it, publish them, and will make their decisions and take appropriate measures based on their final result. Rausord continued, In this situation, I reserve the right to carry out legal actions in defense of my legitimate interests and rights, especially when considering that the announced complaint could be a crime of false accusation and a crime of insult, given its real purpose could only be to stain my personal honor. This matter is in the hands of my lawyer, Mr. Diego Artacho from the DWFRCD law firm. Barcelona have announced the restructuring of their club board after six directors resigned. I have never questioned the honorability of our beloved club and its employees. On the contrary, I feel very honored to have been able to serve my beloved Barca and to have had the opportunity to meet people who work in the club with great professional and human qualities. My intention at all times has been to be consistent with my performance on the board since the beginning. With actions guided by transparency, honesty and respect, and not to disappoint the trust that was placed in the board in past elections. Bartomeu has been forced to reshuffle the figures at boardroom level, after Maria Tessied Orange or the Calcemilia joined Rausord, Enrique Tombas, Silvia Elias and Josep Pon in walking away. The resignations threatened Bartomeu's position, 
leaving him with just 12 directors. But the high-profile figures that remain are widely expected to stay loyal to the club leaving the 57-year-old able to look ahead to his final year in charge. Read more, Let's Block Ads. Why?